Oh my fucking god, time for a new vlog. How the fuck are we doing today, guys? I'm doing awesome and sexy things for all. Louise asking. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck is this? E Alright, anyways, sorry, I just got a goddamn fucking text message. Alright, so, anyways, Jagex today released player own ports, and today I actually got a foot tattoo. It was actually the most painful tattoo I have ever gotten, and probably most likely not going to be doing my other foot. Probably most likely going to be a RuneScape video showing, you know, a little show and tell type video and shit, because I know you guys actually kind of like stuff like that, so yeah. That video might be uploaded later and shit uh, in the late evening. But anyways, upload a new video basically showing a guide, fucking player ports, little minigame is Scrabadanza. Um, it, it's really a different form of fucking RuneScape, hence where it's, it's, it's kind of funny because, you know, hence where sailing uh, might come into play. <laughs> I, I mean, it's fucking, um, it's pretty funny because, like, like for example, Jagex for the longest time back in like 2008, said, oh, no, sailing isn't going to be a new scale. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> what is this sailing? Uh, then, like, two years later, they came off Dungeoneering. Maybe they were planning on release player-owned ports back then, and they just kind of, you know, had some information leaked. Uh, you, you know, you really never know. Uh, but anyways, yeah, so that video is uploaded on my main channel. I'll also upload a gaming video, and yeah. Last night, I did three occult floors, got some... Got about, you know, 300,000 Dungeoneering EXP. Not the worst Dungeoneering EXP I've gotten in one night. And, uh, that's basically pretty much about it. Tonight, I'm probably not going to be doing Dungeoneering because I'm probably going to be fletching my balls off and watching some movies. Alright, but today, I kind of really want to talk about... <clears throat> my voice is cracking again. <laughs> 24 years old and I just hit puberty. For some reason, you guys think that I'm fucking 30. Do I really look 30? I mean, I know I've aged in the past, like, two fucking years, you know, a lot, but, uh, still. Anyways, alright. Um, one thing I kind of really want to talk about is making money on this game and, uh, utilizing crashing items. Now, I, I know I've already talked about this, you know, in the past, but, um, it was actually funny because I actually did something while everything was crashing in the past, like, two and a half weeks in the Grand Exchange. I actually ended up selling my Bandos, my Armadale, my fucking Dragon Full Helm, uh, my Dragon Plate Body, and, uh, yeah, that's, that's basically pretty much about it. <laughs> um, and I've actually just recently bought everything back. Um, and I ended up, I, I only made fucking 10 mil, and I actually am kind of pissed off because I could have probably made between maybe 20 to 25 mil, because there was one time where Bandos fucking hit a, a down, you know, it's just people were getting rid of it like in STD. You know, people just did not want it. <laughs> Gotta get rid of this fucking herpes. I don't want it anymore. Um, but anyways, yeah, so it, I, I kind of waited until Sunday because Saturday evening was when everything, you know, this past Saturday, everything started fucking rising like a fucking boater. Um, and it's just because things naturally rise up. Uh, but otherwise, I only made about 10 mil, which is, you know, 10 mil that I do not have. There are people out there that don't even have a 10 mil bank, um, but I could have made a little more. And basically, yes, I know that I taught you guys never to sell your fucking items, but now things have really kind of changed. Rare items, you don't want to do this to. Rare items are fucking too valuable and too unpredictable. But as for items that are constantly being added to the game, like bandos, etc., etc., you can make some money on the side. Uh, basically, all you have to do is when an item is crashing, you fucking sell that item, and then you buy the item back lower than what you fucking sold it for. So, if an item is 10 mil... And if it crashed down to 9 mil, you probably most likely maybe can sell it for maybe like 8.5, hopefully, maybe like 8.2, 8.1, possibly 8 mil. Then when the item crashes to like maybe 7 or 6.5 mil, you buy it back, and you still have your fucking bandos, and you just made some money. 
Woohoohoo! It's easy as that. That's basically that's all you really have to do. Um, and with armor, it's really not that hard to get fucked. I mean, you can get fucked over, but it's not in the same sense that difficult. A rare item is a lot easier to get fucked over with because if you sell a purple party hat for maybe like 980 and it crashed 10 mil, then it rose up by 50 mil. Oh, not a good time. Yeah, you're basically pretty much uh, be fucked. Um, but that's just, you know, then again, rare items in general. Like, like I said, I, I had a friend who played this game and he got fucked out of a party hat. And uh, he regrets selling it because rare items are rare items. And people, people really haven't understood yet that vagina mass... Fish mass, yes, they are smelly, ugly fucking vagina mass, um, but they are a rare item. They seriously, I mean, they, they really are. They're just fucking rare to the game. Um, and there's going to be a point in time where that item is going to go up. Up, 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 up. <laughs> um, yeah, so... I don't really know when, but there will be a time. Trust me in general. Alright guys, but like I basically pretty much said, um, I might do one occult floor tonight, uh, may not. But don't really think I'll be doing four fucking floors. Kinda really wanna watch, uh, where's that guy in movie? Movie, 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 movie! It's called Apartment 143, and then I kinda wanna watch this other one on Netflix called ATM. Ass to mouth, yes! <laughs> I love you, 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 I love Netflix. Alright, but anyways, right now I'll go to my email address. You have to read off some happy hooba hooba questions from you motherfuckers. Ask number two who dot I to be you who's because if you do drink to me to you who's well then Netflix will die and crash and burn. First hooba hooba question. Hi mom! All of a sudden you realize reading my email of awesome the awesomeness doesn't mean anything and it is too late to stop reading. Thanks for Letting me waste your time. Smiley face. Our username. Ate your house. This is the definition of a troll. It should be shot, burned, and raped by all of our wieners. <laughs> Just go ahead and rape it. <laughs> uh, but anyways, guys, let me know in some nasty, dirty little comments if you guys are doing the new minigame player-owned ports. Otherwise, I'll see you happy, motivated motherfuckers tomorrow, and bye.